Hello everybody and welcome to our third part of our tutorial we are working on this part square tool holder and we finished on this stage of our part let's get back and see what else we'll do we'll work on this feature we'll add a material this is this is the shape it's 3 by 20 and 10 and from down to up by 6 millimeters let's go back to our inventor and draw it what I, I want to mention here it's not started from the beginning as we can see it goes there by 16 millimeter so we have to create a parallel plane to this face and drag it by 16 millimeter there okay let's go here go to our planes and here if you click this small black arrow you can see several ways to draw our planes we need an offset plane from a plane or from a face so we'll take this one or this one it's the same we'll click here and don't take your finger out of your mouse and drag so you click and drag in the same way I'll cancel it and do it again if you click it will give you a plane and you can you see so I have to click and drag or I'll take this offset click and drag it's the same so we need minus 16 millimeter we are going with minus here and hit finish this way we make a parallel plane to a face or to a plane click on your plane and create a 2d sketch I prefer to make a slice here working on the plane so I'll hit F7 and I slice my part temporary in order to work on my plane with my view cube and I'll draw a line on this line okay and another line from down up and another line from end of this one to end of this one this way I finish my shape I'll give it some dimension it's 6 millimeter from down from down to here 6 millimeter this piece is 3 millimeter and this piece uh, segment is 10 and all my height from here to here or this line it will be 20 okay so I finish my sketch I'll hit finish and I'll extrude this shape the other way by 70 seven zero okay I'll get rid of my plane right click and click on the visibility in order to turn it off I need another one on other side of my part so here it's very easy to use the mirror tool I'll click a mirror click the feature and a mirror plane as I told you in the previous videos I'll use my origin because I set my part and I'll use the YZ plane mirror plane again this is my YZ plane this is my XZ plane oh my god plane 
my YZ plane we can see the top view it will be mirrored symmetrically to the other part I'll hit OK and voila this is my part is ready now from both sides this way we use our mirror tool and in next videos let us do some fillet first let us fill it this fillet is how much this fillet is by 6 so I'll click and give it 6 here select and select the edge that you want to fill it and hit OK and here is our fillet so we'll finish our video now and we'll dig some holes in the next video and finish our part see you later